Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you a new functionality in Mesh Morpher, which allows us to blend more precisely uh, morph targets, right? So we can draw uh, blending with uh, brush tools or by selection, right? So we have uh, three morph targets that uh, we will uh, experiment with in this video. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Let's uh, create a new uh, morph target on our mesh. Let's uh, give it a name. And uh, just wait a little bit for the morph target to be created and double click on it to open it, right? Let's uh, switch to our blend tool. And uh, let's switch to our focus material mode. And uh, now we can uh, select uh, blend tool, which is the late, uh, latest in, uh, it's the last in this list here. And uh, let's select a new, uh, let's select our uh, morph target we want to uh, blend with, right? First we will go with the uh, ape and uh, if we we'll draw uh, like a normal sculpt tool, we can uh, add uh, uh, the deformation to our uh, existing morph target, right? Uh, if uh, you want to smooth a little bit, you can always smooth, do whatever here, right? It's up to you. Let's uh, go with uh, a small uh, strength here, we don't want to push too hard. And uh, we can also uh, go ahead and apply a blend to a selection. So <clears throat> if uh, we select our head shader, right, it's our head uh, material here, and uh, select the reptile for example, and apply blend, it will change our our selection with the what we have in the morph target by this alpha alpha by the selected alpha right we can also append the deltas so the deltas from the reptile will be appended to whatever we have here and uh, this is uh, how it looks pretty good actually we have an ape with the reptile skin and uh, now let's uh, let's do another thing let's Clear the selection and uh, let's uh, let's uh, replace the ears from the lichen, right? So this is how we do it, and uh, we can also smooth a little bit this area, or we can bring it more precisely from our morph target, right? Kind of. Uh, let's. Uh, let's Decrease a little bit this brush size here. And holding shift smooth is right. So let's let's increase the strength a little bit. And now we can have a reptile with an ape and the lichen ears, right? So this is uh, the functionality I wanted to show you. This allows us uh, a lot of control when uh, we want uh, to blend multiple morph targets together. I hope uh, you find this new functionality useful and uh, see you around. Bye.